Over the weekend, the U.S. military shot down a suspected Chinese spy balloon after it drifted off the country's east coast. As war continues to collect debris from the balloon, a senior U.S. general admitted that the military had not detected previous spy balloons under the Trump and Biden administrations because of what he called an awareness gap. Pei has more. A senior U.S. Air Force general responsible for bringing down a Chinese spy balloon said its military had a, quote, domain awareness gap that allowed other suspected Chinese spy balloons to transit the continental U.S. undetected. The head of U.S. North American Aerospace Defense Command and Northern Command, Glenn Van Hark, was speaking in a press briefing on Monday local time, but did not provide details on previous balloons, including where over the United States they flew. His remarks come after the Pentagon has said over the weekend that Chinese spy balloons had briefly flown over the U.S. at least three times during Donald Trump's presidency and once before during the current administration. Van Herk added that the U.S. determined the previous flights after the fact based on additional means of collection of intelligence without offering further details. The senior U.S. general added the latest balloon was up to 200 feet or about 60 meters tall and carried a payload weighing over 900 kilograms. He did not rule out the possibility that there could have been explosives on the balloon, but also said he did not have any evidence of it either. But he added that risk was a factor in planning to shoot down the balloon over open water. On Saturday, the U.S. shot down the suspected spy balloon using an F-22 Raptor fighter jet, supported by multiple fighters and refueling aircraft. But China strongly condemned the military strike, saying that the balloon was used for meteorological and other scientific purposes. Pei Arirang News.